play the tin game. This is going to be stage one. Luna knows this game, so this shouldn't take too long for her to do. What I do is I have the tin in my hand, and I have a cup below, and I'm just going to present it. She puts her nose on it. She gets a treat. In her case, she's going to hold it, hold her nose there, because she knows that's what she's supposed to do. In this stage, I don't care if they hold their nose there or not. Cookie. I'm going to send her off so I can switch hands. More treats. Notice my treat hand isn't anywhere near the tin. Drop it. I don't care if she's looking at the treat hand or wherever else she's looking. Don't care if she holds her nose at this stage. I just want her to touch it and get rewarded. In this case, she knows how to hold because she's done all these games. And ultimately, this is what I want her to do when we get to a find out in the real world. I want her to hold her nose there. I switch hands. Try not to make a, the same number each time um, because I don't want this to become a exercise and she can count and, and just know that this is how it's going to happen. You can rest your um, elbow on your knee if you need to to make it easier. I drop it. She puts her nose on it. I bring the treat in. She drops it. Or I dro she puts her nose on it. I bring the treat in. She touches it. I bring the treat in. She touches it. I bring the treat in. If you're trying to get her to eat on the tin, all done. Nice job. So that she's taking in the scent at the same time that she is eating the treat.